What is up everybody, Hoosier Pulls here today. Thank you so much for joining me. I truly appreciate it. If you're new, welcome. I am super excited because I got in one of the hottest tops collaboration boxes of the summer, and that is the Show Out Collection by Julio Rodriguez. This looks like a super fun product, so we're gonna get into it, see what kind of value it has. So without further ado, let's go. All right, everybody, here we go. The Show Out Collection by Julio Rodriguez. I am super excited. Let's get into the details of this product. All right, so each box has three packs per box. There are 36 total autographed signers in this checklist. We have one in four boxes contain an autograph and one in 60 packs contain the ever elusive anime SSP. I also wanted to note that this is a smaller uh, total checklist. There are 70 cards in the checklist. Um, this was exclusively designed uh, by Julio Rodriguez. Um, he pretty much had a hand in everything from the design to who's on the checklist to the autograph signers. So uh, it also says one autograph or relic card per box. So not too bad. I believe all the relics are Julio. But this is a great design. Uh, the product looks great. Uh, the box is really, really sick. I'll definitely have to uh, add it to the back there. All right, so we get three packs per box. The inside is really, really cool. Um, the actual design of the card is great. I believe it's designed after the crest of the Dominican Republic. Um, there was a little segment on uh, MLB Network that showed Julio uh, designing, you know, his own cards, and it was really cool. We first saw the sneak preview of this at the MLB All-Star Game this year, and I didn't know if it was going to be like an All-Star Game exclusive, but we did end up getting it on Tops.com. So here we go. We have Paul Goldschmidt. The cardstock is really nice. It's really glossy. Uh, looks like we got a little parallel back there. Um, but the design is really clean. It's very, very nice. I really like it. We got Paul Goldschmidt, Mark McGuire, and most of the people on the checklist are top stars as well. We have a Anthony Volpe out of 99. This is a really, really nice looking parallel. We're going to get this sleeved up. All right, so here we go. Anthony Volpe. Now, these are really thick. Um, not super thick, but uh, I would recommend like a 55 point top loader. I do not have one of those right now, so we're just going to keep him in a sleeve. All right, so we got Miggy, end of a great career um, this year. We have Nomar Garcia Parra, played for my Cubbies, and Bryce Harper. Love to see Bryce get into the altercation with uh, Angel Hernandez. I'm super excited about the playoffs, too. The playoffs are almost here. I cannot wait. Fred Lynn, although my Cubbies did not get in, but that's all right. I'm still excited for October baseball. We got Oswald Peraza. We have Juan Marichal out of 75. Nice little uh, purple foil there, Juan Marichal. We'll get him up on the stand. So we got a top rookie and a Hall of Famer. Definitely can't complain. We got Jay Buhner, the classic player right there. Steven Kwan. We got Masataka Yoshida. That's a nice rookie there. And the Machine, Albert Pujols, shout out Houdini Sports. All right, last pack of the first box. This one feels thick, so I'm assuming it's going to be a relic, but we shall see. Yep, looks like we got a relic in this one, but that's all right. It seems like every pack has had a numbered card parallel, which is really sweet. We got Carlton Fisk. We got Teoscar Hernandez. And, oh, this is really cool. We have a Julio Rodriguez behind the scenes with Tops. This was from those little uh, commercials that he was doing for uh, Top Series 1, I believe. Uh, they were really, really fun. Um, so that's a pretty cool card. He was doing like the little Bob Ross skit. And our relic is going to be Julio Rodriguez out of 199. So that is a really, really sweet card. We'll put him up on the... All right, so this is pretty sweet. Little Julio uh, Relic out of 199. So really, really nice looking Relic card. I like Relic cards. Um, I think it's fun. The This product is really, really fun. Uh, we got uh, Black and Gold Julio. We'll move him over here. Then uh, last but not least, we got Jordan, Amad Rosario, Giancarlo Stanton, and Mike Piazza. So that was one box. I thought that was a lot of fun, honestly. I'm having a great time. 
I'm glad I got two boxes. We'll see if we can uh, beat the odds and pull an autograph here or one of the anime SSP inserts. But we did hit the Anthony Volpe out of 99. This is a great collaboration. Uh, I really like these uh, these types of player collaborations from Topps. Uh, they're not you know everyone's cup of tea, but I think it's pretty fun. It's just a just a great looking set. So. Here we go. We have David Ortiz, Big Poppy, Michael Harris. That's a nice little rookie card right there. And our, ooh. Okay, I thought I thought we might have had an auto here, but we have a Julio Rodriguez parallel to one ninety nine. So the man himself making an appearance. All right, then we got Nolan Arenado, Gunnar Henderson, Corbin Carroll. And Randy Rosarena would love to see a Gunner or Corbin Carroll parallel in there. Also looking for that elusive anime SSP. So we got Juan Marichal, Cal Raleigh, our parallel. Maybe. This is uh, Julio Rodriguez, Mariners clinch postseason for the first time. This might be a parallel. I'm going to check it out. All right, so this might just be an SP. I'll have to look at the odds. That's still a pretty cool card. We got the Big Hurt, Frank Thomas, Jared Kelnick, Bryce Harper, and Luis Castillo. So you will see a couple of duplicates in here, you know, because it is a shorter uh, checklist. But let's see what we got for the last pack. If you've enjoyed this uh, review, if you've enjoyed this video, please consider giving me a like. It really helps me out. I have a blast. Uh, making these videos for you guys. We got Mookie Betts, and it looks like we have another relic card. It is Julio Rodriguez out of 199. So it is a different. Oh, it looks like. Okay, I thought it, I thought it was the anime. So we have a a different shot, little action shot there. Julio out of 199. That's pretty cool. But it looks like we have a nice little insert back here. Fountain of Youth. It is going to be Yoshida. That is a sweet looking card. That is really, really nice. They also have like Gunnar Henderson, I believe like Adley Rutschman. So that's pretty sweet. So we have Yoshida there. And then the rest, we have Prince Fielder, Manny Machado, Cal Ripken Jr., and Adelis Garcia. All right, we're going to recap real quick. All right, everybody, here's our recap. Here's our stack of base. We got some of the top rookies like Corbin Carroll, um, we did get the Julio Rodriguez behind the scenes card. That was pretty cool. And going into our hits, we have Juan Marichal out of 75 Hall of Famer pitcher right there. We have this Yoshida Fountain of Youth. That's a really, really sweet looking card. And then getting into uh, some of the best hits from the boxes, we have these two Julio Relic cards, both out of 199, but they do have different poses, so that's pretty cool that they're not like the exact same card. I really like those. And then we were able to hit the J-Rod out of 199, Rainbow Foil. And then probably the best hit was this Anthony Volpe out of 99. Let me know what you guys think. I had an absolute blast. As always, thank you so much for tuning in and taking the time out of your busy day and your busy schedule to watch my videos. It truly means the world to me. So until next time, we're gonna keep growing, keep making videos. We'll see you later.